Hey everybody, so today's video is on my top favorite shampoos. So I love these shampoos mainly because they keep my hair soft and healthy and shiny. I love the shine and most importantly, hydrated. So what are some things that I look for in a good shampoo? As I've said before in previous videos, I really like shampoos that aren't clear, that are, um, you know, thick, like opaque and creamy looking. I find that those shampoos have more moisturizers in them. They're not as tough on your hair. They don't strip your hair as much. But you'll see here that I've got a few shampoos that look clear and they are great. I've tested them. I love them. Um, again, I'm looking for shampoos that don't leave my hair so tangled and dry looking that it just helps along that conditioning and detangling process. And frankly, I look for shampoos that smell nice too. Like I, I love clean, wonderful smelling hair. So all of the shampoos that I'm gonna feature hit all of those marks. So my number one favorite shampoo is Joico Moisture Recovery Shampoo. Sadly, I ran out of it last week and I, I, don't, I threw out the bottle. But it comes in, I get the liter sizes because I go through shampoo, especially conditioner, like crazy. You can get it at any good salon or beauty supply stores. It's my favorite. It's creamy, it leaves your hair feeling soft and moisturized, and it smells kind of fruity, like tropical fruity. I, I really, really love that one. And I apologize for not having a bottle to show you guys. But I've talked about it before. My second favorite shampoo of all time is Schwarzkopf's Moisture Bonacure Hair Therapy Cell Protector Repair Rescue Deep Nourishing Shampoo. <laughs> These names are ridiculous, but yeah, this is a favorite of mine. It works beautifully in conjunction with the Repair Rescue uh, deep conditioner that that is my favorite conditioner of all time. Why do I like this? It leaves your hair really nice and soft Really hydrated and it doesn't weigh your hair down whatsoever. This is a really really good one especially if you have dry thick or coarse hair or all three of those This is like it, it totally babies your hair. So I paid it was on sale $22.44 for this at Chatters. It regularly goes for $37.39, but I think that's awesome because it's a liter size. It's really, really big, and this lasts me months. So yeah, really, really good one. And it's nice and thick, and it's a um, opaque cream. Let's see if I could get a shot of this. So next up is a drugstore favorite that I've been using on and off for about, I don't know, a year, year and a half. This was sent to me by Garnier. This is Garnier Whole Blend Smoothing Shampoo. Uh, it's coconut oil and cocoa butter. It smells lovely. And as you can see, it's a clear bottle. It's a clear shampoo. And I really, really like this because again, it's a really effective shampoo. It gets your hair really nice and clean and it's very hydrating and moisturizing, does not leave your hair feeling stripped whatsoever. And it smells like the islands, like the coconut oil and cocoa butter. It smells fantastic. It's like five or six dollars for the price. It is excellent. On top of all of that, it's paraben free. It does have silicones in it. Um, I don't have problems with silicones. I, I find they, like, like my, my hair is pretty resilient. It's pretty strong. I take really, really good care of it too. Um, I've had no problems with this whatsoever. And again, for the price, it is really, really great. They have a whole line of them, but I really like the ones with the one with coconut oil and cocoa butter in it. So another one I've been using is Fresh Avocado Frizz Control Shampoo with sweet almond oil and hibiscus. And I was sent this by La Coupe a few weeks ago and I've been testing it. This shampoo is so thick and so rich. It's a creamy shampoo and it's amazing. Like it, it promotes deep hydration and frizz control. I found this really smoothed my hair out. It was really, really nice. And what I love about testing out new shampoos is that by switching up your shampoo, I find like you're 
Your hair looks amazing. It's like your hair got a shot of life and shine and that's exactly what this did for me. It left my hair feeling soft and very manageable. Again, really, really shiny. Uh, my hair, yeah, my hair felt super soft after using this and the matching conditioner. I really, really, really like this. And Avocado is a known fantastic hydrator. My mom uses um, mashed avocado and puts it in her hair as a mask. So yeah, stands to reason that this would be really, really good. I really, really like it. And last but not least is Paul Mitchell's shampoo number three. It's a clarifying shampoo. This is really, really great um, at getting rid of built up residue in your hair. So if you're using a lot of oils to deep condition your hair or a lot of hairsprays and, and styling products like that, this is fantastic because it strips your hair from all of that and then really allows deep conditioners to do a great job. So this stuff is a clear shampoo. It does leave your hair feeling stripped. Don't be alarmed. It is a great, it, it, like it leaves your hair open for deep conditioning. So I will use this once every month, month and a half, usually right before relaxers actually. Not right before relaxers, like two weeks before a relaxer. And then I will put a thick deep conditioner on or deep condition with a, like a nice oil mix. Leave that on my hair for an hour or two and my hair looks incredible. So shiny and really bouncy. It's fabulous. Like my hair loves this stuff. If you guys are swimmers, this goes for whatever type of hair you have. This stuff is really, really good too because it gets rid of all of the chlorine in your hair. So this is a fantastic one. I have been using this for years and years and years. My hairstylist recommends it for me. My hairstylist recommended it to me and I've been using it ever since. In fact, Gloria uses this as her weekly shampoo and her hair looks amazing. Gloria has amazing hair. So yeah, those are my favorite shampoos. Do you guys have anything to add? Um, do you guys have a favorite shampoo that you would like to share with me? I would love to know. Um, I love trying out new shampoos, but I generally stick to the same products because I, like, I, I don't like shocking my hair too much. Yes, I'm a beauty blogger. Yes, I try lots of different products, but I go easy on the hair products. If I get a shampoo or conditioner, I look at it. I look at the I look at the ingredient list, and I make sure that it's it won't strip my hair. That that gives me a good sense of whether or not it'll be good for me. So yeah, please share any favorite shampoos of yours. I'm also looking for good drugstore brands also. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.